My name is Harold Adam from the Victorian Department of Primary Industries based at Tatura. To schedule irrigation accurately we can use the internal water status of the tree. We can measure this using a pressure chamber. The first thing we need to do is to take a leaf sample from the tree and um, wrap it in a wet tissue. Then we take the leaf sample to the instrument to measure the water status of the tree. The next thing we need to do is trim the petiole on the leaf in preparation for inserting it into the pressure chamber. So I use a razor blade to do this, like so, and then insert the leaf into the pressure chamber. We then take the leaf sample and place it in the lid of the pressure chamber, like, like so, and then seal, seal the lid with the stem of the leaf protruding through the lid. We put the lid back on the chamber and pin it in place. Then we pump the chamber and when we see sap coming from the stem of the leaf, we then take a reading of the pressure inside. We keep pumping the chamber until we see sap coming from the end of the cut leaf stem. Then we take a reading on the pressure gauge and that tells us the water status of the tree or how tightly water is held within the tree. Using the pressure chamber to measure stem water potential or the water status of the tree gives us an absolute figure, a reading on the gauge, so we can tell whether the tree is under water stress and schedule our irrigation accordingly.